Well, this particular video will have a lot of miscellaneous things, stuff on the farm. Uh, also, uh, some uh, filming of a neighboring county fair. Also, a fair that uh, I was judging in another county. So, hope you find some of this uh, particular video interesting. And again, at the end, as we always said, I ask that uh, you like and share and subscribe to my channel. I would appreciate it. probably a little bit crazy trying to uh, weed eat along our county road to make uh, our property look a little bit nicer but that's what I do and it's even more crazy to do it in this high heat and humidity <laughs> This is the Supreme Heifer Drive at the Monroe County Fair. This is the Grand Steer Drive at the Monroe County Fair. I'm not going to film all of it, but here's the lineup.
think there's uh, three, maybe four heifers in contention up here, and I want to pull some of those up side to side so I can get uh, a better comparison of them. Uh, let's give this group of exhibitors a nice round of applause. No matter what I say tonight, these folks are going to take these heifers home, and they're going to be good moms, and they're going to bring back 4-H calves out of those in, in a few years. Uh, and I'm not going to go back through and talk all those. I see judges do that all the time. But you can see, obviously, there's some types and kinds out here as well. Uh, there's three heifers up there kind of side to side. They're just kind of massive. They've got a lot of a lot of rib shape to them. Uh, the condition maybe is not ideal on one or two of them, but, uh, but boy, do they have capacity. Do they have rib shape? Do they have some bone structure to them? Uh, could some of them be a little more feminine on the front end? Certainly. Uh, and then we have a heifer back here, the Red Angus heifer that, you know, for a breed type, she's a really nice heifer, but when you look at capacity compared to some of those that stand up in front of her, you know, you just think, wow, uh, it's just pretty impressive what you've got up there in those other three heifers. So I'm going to, it's a tough decision, quite honestly, I'm going to go out and just uh, pick the one that I like. Do I think there's an ideal one out here? I don't think God's ever made the perfect one. Uh, and I, I can I can tell you faults that I see and some of them that I don't like, but I can tell you the good things I see about it. But, uh, but those are some nice heifers in the show already tonight. So for you family folks at home and your breeders, congratulations to all of you. And I'll go out and pick the champion reserve. Thank you. 